are, or I am, almost on the way to race side to get the cell phone booster installed the way I had uh, originally requested and get the um, antenna moved to the back of the vehicle. Uh, hopefully there won't be any more wind noise. Um, I just tried filling the truck up for the first time since I brought it back to Rayside last time and it seems to be filling up with no spillage so I'm happy they were able to fix that problem. Um, but now I can't get into the toolbox um, so I don't know if it was them or if it just was coincidence but they were the last ones to open the toolbox and I can't get into it. So I'm going to hopefully have them be able to open it up for me. Something's caught in the latch, I'm assuming. So lots of uh, things getting fixed as usual. What's happening? Living the dream, man. Now he was saying that the, um, we were talking about it briefly this morning. He was saying that you have, um, because you have the power seats and that there's the, the box doesn't fit underneath the seat where you guys originally talked about it because of the power seat. I don't know. I, I mean, it could be true. I, it's not that big. It's pieces. it's like this. I mean, it's not big. Um, and then the um, antenna wires and the phone or the uh, cigarette lighter plug is only so long. So when we find a place, it may not be able to go. The antenna might not go where the third brake light is. Yeah, I'm looking. Um, I mean, this is, you know, pretty much the di diagram they have on a on a car. There were two issues with the way they installed the cell phone booster initially. One is they hid the main box inside my center council. Um, you couldn't access it unless you removed the center council. And two, the antenna made a lot of noise whistling right above my head. So we were just trying to figure out how to best install it, um, how I originally requested that they do it. All right, guys, so I just left Rayside. They got the uh, cell phone booster fixed. They fixed the um, toolbox. And uh, the cell phone booster, I'm much happier with the way it looks. And I can see the box now. It's under my seat, so I'll show you guys that. You know, and it shouldn't really get in the way of anything. We moved the um, interior antenna right here in between the seat and my center council. Um, I've always heard, you know, that you want to be as close as possible to it, so, um, you know, the phone usually rests right there on our center council, so that's, you know, six inches away from it. Not bad. So I'm excited to uh, see how this works. Yeah, and the uh, out exterior antenna is now mounted on the rear of the roof right above the uh, third brake light so looks a lot better and um, I won't have any kind of wind noise which is super super exciting because that wind noise would drive me nuts To the burrow, name another cat that be rapping this thorough. Nine five flow, spilling whiskey on the shirt though. Legends don't die, I'll spit fire out the urn though. Uh, at a bar by my lonely, talking to the bartender, hoping she'll console me. I know I'm such a puzzle, but I'm hoping she can solve me. Have another beer till the fear disappears, homie. Uh, I ask if they have Spotify and an iPhone charger, phone about to die. Yeah, I wanna listen to some Death Cab, AMC breaking. No meth lab A visit to my heart Here's a guest pass for your ass I'll be famous soon in case your ass Wait, what number am I on your list? Yes, if I'm not top ten Then we are not friends uh. I'm in my own city Feeling out of place Starbucks on every corner We still ain't awake Just another day Just another day Stumble down the subway stairs Through the summer haze And think about my next steps yeah. And think about my next steps and think about my next steps and think about my next steps I get my phone back from the bartender And now I'm lonely and I'm drunk so my heart's tender So I send you a text, see if you're still awake You told me I should So I'm sitting outside, it's raining And I'm watching some YouTube Do It Justice They're pretty cool, I've been watching them for a while Check them out But uh, yeah, it's storming
typical summer in Florida. Yep. I got the brew man with me here. <laughs> Holy crap, look at that spider web. Can't keep those spiders off. Man, I love these awnings. It's been storming every day. And I still have a nice dry area out here. Pretty sweet. Florida weather. So as if I needed another problem to deal with, I think I bumped my hard drive and I ended up spending the entire evening and the next day trying to fix it. I was able to recover some of or most of my video files, but I ended up losing some of them. Thankfully it wasn't a total loss and uh, now I have a backup, but you got to remember to back up and take the time to do so. How do you guys back up your data? Any recommendations would be appreciated. Every time it rains, this totally fills up. Now I'm lying in your bed and it's clear to me that for all of this time you were missing me. And I guess it makes sense. So I had mentioned in a previous episode that we're in Florida longer than intended because we're dealing with some family issues. Unfortunately, I'm not able to share the details at this moment, but my mom's going through a lot of stuff and I need to be there for her. I want to be there for her and I'm so lucky and blessed to have a girlfriend that feels the same way and is there to help me and my family at the same time. So, Kato and I were on a mission with the motorcycle that day to do some work and help my mom. If you've been following our journey, you're probably wondering, just as we are, when's all the drama gonna end? Think about my next steps. Thinking. 